Hi there, today I'm going to show you how to replace ink cartridges in a HP OfficeJet 3835. Now this is nice and simple, and can be done from the printer itself using nothing but the machine, and there's no need to have an attached PC or laptop. So, with the printer on and ready to print otherwise, we need to go below the scan bed, like you would do on some printers, and we're going to pull down the little fascia on the front here. There's like a clip on both sides. Press in, you can lower that down. Now, there's another little barrier here. Just in here, there's like a recessed part. Put your finger in and you pull down, it comes loose. Your printer will realize that you've opened that and move the ink cartridge cradle along to the central position. Now in front of the cartridges, you can see there's markings for color and black. The pink representing the tricolor, the black representing the black cartridge. So, we lean in, press down on whichever cartridge you like and you hear a click as the cartridge comes loose. You can then remove the cartridge. Grab your replacement cartridge. I'm going to pop the same one back in because there's, there's no need for me to change this cartridge. But when you have your new cartridge, make sure any protective packaging has been removed. These will quite often come with a protective clip on the front, especially from the remanufactured cartridges. And it's also worthwhile noting, these will quite often have like a protective tape that covers the bottom of the cartridge where ink comes out quite often kind of come up with like a paper tab covering these electronic contacts on the front. Some cartridges have it across and going up the side. So make sure you've taken anything off before you pop them in. To get it back in, we're doing essentially the opposite. You're putting it in at that angle you can see there until it gets to the back and you lift it up. Do you hear that click? And it should be sat level with the other cartridge. Obviously repeat if you need to do the same thing for the black cartridge. Once you're happy, we just lift this up again. It's kind of spring-loaded, so it snaps back into position very easily. And your printer will start taking a look at the cartridges. And assuming it's happy, it will return you to the home page of the printer. You can then close the second door. Make sure it's clicked in on both sides. And you're good to carry on printing. Hope you found this video useful. If you have, let me know with a like. If there's anything else we can help with, drop it down in the comments. Otherwise, thank you for taking the time to watch this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.